We don't know how long this war will last. But as we approach the two-month mark, here's what we do know. Putin has failed to achieve his grand ambitions on the battlefield. After weeks of shelling Kyiv, Kyiv still stands. President Zelensky and his democratically elected government still remain in power. And the Ukrainian armed forces, joined by many brave Ukrainian civilians, have thwarted Russia's conquest of their country. They've been bolstered from day one by an unstinting supply of weapons, ammunition, armor, intelligence from the nations of the free world, led by us, the United States. As Russia continues to grind out the military advances and their military advances and the brutalities against Ukraine, Putin is banking on us losing interest. That's been my view. You heard me say this from the beginning. He was counting on NATO, European Union, our allies in, in Asia, cracking, moving away. He's betting on Western unity will crack. He's still betting on that. And once again, we're going to prove him wrong. We will not lessen our revolve. We're going to continue to stand with the brave and proud people of Ukraine. We will never fail in our determination to defend freedom and oppose tyranny. It's as simple as that. 